I pull up in foreign whips. Hey, touch your leg with my fingertips. You looking in that rear view. Yeah, do you listen? Then you blow a kiss. It's all about the way that your silhouette do a pirouette. The form of two naked bodies in bed. Yeah, a beat sting only for a taste. The spring revives whatever went into you. You ever feel it was never real? Like everything we built was only time to kill. I never was the one to rely on. Yo, what is up guys, welcome back to the vlog, welcome back to the channel, Gang Fam Squad, what is up? It is day two, bright and early, we're back working on the GTR, no days off, we got 30 days till Battle of the Bluegrass, can't be fucking around. The front bumper is now done from paint, we are going to go pick that up today as well. Swap that out, we are going to finish the lines on the other side of the car, start putting the trunk back together, and in today's vlog we're going to see a lot of progress done. So, without further ado, baby, let's get right on into it, thank you guys so much for watching, let's get it started. These bitches going crazy, they going crazy. You know you rappers who gaze, we all in relays. Like I'm living wavy, I'm wavy. My shit is low, it can call it bold. It's a ball, I'm a mess, your bitch, a quarter, it's a dog. Okay, new bumper is secure. We got it, we're gonna bring it home. Okay, we just got the new GTR bumper back from paint. Pearlescent seems to match up really nice. Now I'm just going over. The area is with the bolts, so I'll know how to take this apart without struggling. And uh, the nice guys at the shop heard what happened. I've known them a long time. They actually shot my bumper. They charged zero dollars, not a dime. So shout out to those guys, man. They did a very good job. We're definitely gonna be putting this on today, this vlog. So without further ado, let's get started on the GTR where we left off yesterday. Okay, things we have to do today, take this off, swap it with the new one. Run the lines on the other side, finish up the trunk. Looks like it's gonna rain, so let's get started. Okay guys, so we saved some time. I went and ran both lines. They were actually extremely easy compared to yesterday's adventure. So just for a little eye candy, we have these 90 degree PTCs. We put on the VU4, I'm still waiting and deciding really where I want to mount the VU4 at. I kind of want to put it in front of the tank like so. Maybe have it invert, maybe have the lines running to it like this. I'm not really sure how we're going to do it, but I just wanted, you know, a little extra bling bling on there, whatever, aesthetically pleasing. The right side of the carpet is all tacked away. Next, we're going to do is mount the compressor, put the center carpet in. We have to extend a harness for this to go to the E level, which is in there. So we're gonna extend that today, put that carpet back in. So hopefully by the end of the day, we have all the carpet done pretty much and all the wheels back on minus the one and the new bumper, so let's go. Okay, so they got big trunk progress right now. Right side is in, totally bolted up, good to go. Look at that clearance, just makes it, but everything's good right there. Still have to mount the compressor, haven't really gotten to it yet. All the wiring is starting to look good. We took the air lines, ran them to the top right there. And it's gonna be like that on both sides. We'll have the V4 mounted right in front of it. We'll probably have them cascading down like so. But super clean, we made this custom bracket. I don't know if you guys can see it, but we took some sheet metal, bent it up, mounted it to the frame of the chassis and that gave us enough room to mount the endo tank cleanly. So, it's getting there, slowly but surely, but you know, progress is progress. Now that is some stance right there. Yeah. Man, I cannot wait to get camber arms for this thing, dial them in even more. Man, that is a good looking wheel. What's up everyone? We took a little break. We're going back at it right now. Uh, we're gonna rip off the bumper. It is two piece, so we're gonna have to take out basically the bottom splitter. After the bottom splitter, we'll be able to knock out the bumper. But in the meantime, we got a package from Buddha 13. And I ended up getting 
front camber arms for the GTR. You don't even want to know how much these cost. It was either these versus SPL, and I ran SPLs in the 370Z. There are some things I liked and didn't like about them, so we ended up with the Voodoo 13s. Front camber arms. As you guys saw already, the back fitment is perfect. The front just needs a little tweaking. These right here are going to allow me to take the top of the wheel and push it out. And we're going to zero in that camber because when you air out a car, the wheels tilt in naturally. It's called natural camber. So what this will allow us to do is push that wheel back out and we should have zero camber. We're not going to put these on today. We're going to wait for the wheels to come back, but those babies came. Cost me an arm and a leg. I've never actually taken off the front bumper for the GTR before, so your guess is as good as mine. I've went over some of the boring stuff, started mapping it out, so I'm gonna put you guys down, do what I do best, and let's see if we can get this thing off. Okay, so the bumper is now off. So next step is we have to transfer all the old hardware, the fog lights, the sensors, all that into the new bumper. So this is where it gets technical. Anything can break at any time, so we have to be super careful. Okay, so we have the old bumper, the new bumper. Now we're gonna take everything we just stripped off and put it onto the new one. So here's the old bumper. This thing is totally useless. We have everything out. Now if you notice, do you see the gray in the middle? I said, fuck that. When we got the new bumper, I told him black it all. It just looks way more slick. It's way more aggressive, little customization. So again, you see the grays in the center, it kind of breaks it out. This brings it whole. I just think it looks tougher. What do you guys think? But I'm really fucking with the all black. There they are in the living room. Harriet opens the desk top, closes it. Ozzy scratches his head. Harriet opens the big bottom drawer, closes it. Ozzy scratches his head. Whatever she's looking for, it isn't in there. Perfect, 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 perfect. Okay. All right, guys. So with the help of Cody, we got the front bumper back yeah, on. The do you mind? I think the black on black goes way harder. We'll get the wheels back uh, next week. And once the wheels come back, we'll do the camber arm. So that's it for this one. Looks pretty good. I like the all black a lot more. It flows a lot better. So we're chopping it up for today. I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. 3,100 subscribers on our way. Let's get it. I'll see you guys the next one. Peace out. Although my heart may be weak, it's not alone. It's grown with each new experience. And it's found a home with all the friends I've made. 
I've become part of their herd just as they've become part of mine. And if they think of me now and then, if they don't forget me, then our hearts will be one. I don't need a weapon. Yeah. My friends are my power. power, power, power.